We should do this more often. Let us see. We all go on a vacation. Look at that sky there, bleach. Uh, some people got to take time for vacation. Not everybody does. Mm -hmm. Even poor people can go on vacation now. Get themselves one of them package deals. You know, all inclusives. Oh. I'm about the money, Lucy. I'm starting to get too hot. Now that'll feel like what? swimming, and I don't really Lucy. know what... Lucy! What's that look over there? Man with the strange makeup on! successful at making that classic myth of the Aeneid seem very current. And there's, you know, there's contemporary characters and contexts that we can all identify with, so it, um, it shortens the distance. Probably one of the biggest challenges with this production that excites me a lot is trying to combine the worlds of puppet theatre and actor theatre. And in this case, I've hired three actors. I haven't hired three puppeteers, and yet it's a stage full of puppets. So uh, I went with that choice because there's a lot of deep emotion, there's a lot of beautiful text that has to be handled well, and you need the acting chops to be able to do that. So with Chimame and Dina and Marcelo, we've got a situation where I've got great actors that are now learning how to put their great acting skills into the bodies of puppets, and that's that's an ongoing uh, discovery for us, but one that we're really having fun with. That you know, piece of wood and cloth and you know, marble eyes in front of you, you kind of at a certain level have to take it for what it is and start from there, you know, and, and then this whole aspect of slowing things down, working on the minutia of each movement, you know, it's, it's, it's then by, by kind of letting go of, of what I know that I can go and rediscover how to use and come back with what I know over top, but I have to let go of it first. Since we're talking about values, especially in the context of Quebec society at the moment, one that strikes me the most is family and the transmission of a culture or the beginning of something new where you were unrooted and you have to make roots some, somewhere else. That's what attracted me to the project also. I think it's a really um, important and resonant story right now. I think that Globally, we are looking at how peoples move around the world, how they migrate and immigrate, and the challenges of nations embracing immigrants and handling refugees is really what the story is about. Um, I think, particularly in Quebec right now, that's an important story.